Well, my name is Bailey Pryor, and I own a rum company. Um, I'm here to promote the real McCoy rum and talk about rum in general and the difference between really high-quality spirits uh, within the rum category and, and uh, the sort of lower, lower tier products like uh, industrial alcohol and what the differences are. Because so many people think that just rum is rum. But the reality is uh, there's a huge difference in different types of rum and we're here to discuss that. Industrial rum is made from a large column still, you know, typically four or five towers that you see uh, at, at different distilleries. Uh, made very quickly, very inexpensively. Um, we're a totally different product. You know, we're made primarily with pot still. Uh, so our product is uh, a little more expensive because of the pot still distillate. Because, you know, basically a pot still can make in 18 hours what a column still can make in one hour. But the real difference is that the column still makes essentially like a molasses vodka. It's kind of, you know, not very flavorful, not very aromatic, but the pot still makes it very flavorful, very aromatic, very naturally uh, beautiful products. So um, it, when, you do, when you look at rum, you have to understand that there's a difference between industrial alcohol and then a finely crafted pot still rum. We have our three-year aged white rum. Um, so that actually comes out of the barrel after three years of aging looking a lot like this. It's a little bit lighter, but essentially it looks almost the same color. And that's because the barrels, the wooden barrels, actually give it a, um, uh, that, that patina, that color to it. And then we filter it back to white because people have been trained to think that white rum is what you use for mixed cocktails. So we create that particular product for that. Um, our five-year rum is much more of like a, uh, uh, you know, it's, they're all actually made exactly the same way. They just have different uh, time in the barrel. So you have a little more um, barrel influence, the wooden uh, bourbon casks, and um, it's beautiful. It's a very balanced product. It's our number one seller. Uh, people who like bourbon often go for our five-year. We find that, that happening quite often. And then we have our 12-year aged rum. That's again a finely crafted product, and, and it's been in the barrel for 12 years. So um, you know, the, the, the three-year might be a little bit lighter and fruitier sort of in, in, in its flavor profile. The, the, five-year might have a little more caramel and vanilla flavor than the three and then when you get into the 12 you start adding big beautiful earth tones and wood and char and things like that so that's just what's happening in the barrel and since all three products are made exactly the same way with the same fermentation the same sugarcane source you know the same distillation process uh, it's the time in the barrel that makes the primary difference between the three um, so there's no difference in recipe because we don't add anything to it there's no added sugars or flavors or aromatics uh, so it's it's kind of a time machine